Hi, welcome to Books HD. Today I am going to compare the two games Subway Surfers and Mini and Rush. So, as we all know, both these are running games. So, let's start with Mini and Rush. So, the Mini and Rush is from Gameloft and Universal Studios. And the uh, illumination of the minion makers of the minion. So, as we all know, this is based on the famous um, characters, child, uh, kid friendly characters, minions. So, let's uh, discuss about the things like what are the things we need to play here. So, here we have like uh, so many levels like every level comes in the form of fruit you need to collect three fruits if you collect three fruits it will be very good otherwise if you collect uh, one fruit or uh, you and you can go to the next level like this you have to complete the levels like when you complete the strawberries you you will go to the next level like these kind of fruits plums I think and the next level is the oranges the next level is grapes grapes and after that you'll get apples apples and it are the cherries blue cherries mm, or lemons lemons and this is like Eighth level or something of the coconuts, and you have to complete the section like the bunch of mini games to go. To so let's check the other things here. So the bananas play important role. You can buy some. Uh, even you can buy uh, some of the characters and everything with bananas and the bananas are for you can buy the bananas with real money and these tokens also play important role you have to use these tokens for saving option and everything so the tokens and these are the characters other characters are minions in uh, different forms like the princess vampire dad mom baby and everything and one more thing is you need these kind of um, you will get uh, once you complete some of the tasks you you, you can get these things like uh, rice parts and you will get uh, some special gifts in this and these are the props or vehicle kind of things here so this improves the quality of the game and here you can buy these things so uh, the game goes like the game goes like a race and it covers different areas like uh, uh, for once uh, let's check the random kind of thing here so here we got the super silly fun land and here this is a vector's fortress and sometimes the mini and beach pyramids like this the maps goes on but once you unlock the level and once you complete the level the maps will be with you for always and in addition to that you have the races and events like the global challenge kind of things here and here this is also one kind of race so like this these are all the things like this and one more thing is the special missions sometimes the special missions will appear recently they closed the special mission kind of thing finished like this uh, so these are based on like the this special mission the last one, special mission was based on the movie Despicable Me 3 um, like the villain character and everything so the special missions 
like um, they give you some extra market tickets the market is closed right now the market tickets and the special gifts and sometimes you'll get some special costumes and everything so as the minions are funny characters you'll get a lot of fun while playing like this so let's check the level one here it starts with gross lab as we all know the gross lab minions make jellies and other things and you can use some boosters while you play but i am not using any boosters as i completed this level and he, while you run if you um, like this if you hit some minion your multiplayer will increase the despicable bonus will increase so you have to like you have to hit as many minions as possible to get this thing so let's go to the other level so like this there are so many maps and per if you want to access for the second uh, level you have to complete the previous level like this i can show here uh, at present we are in the coconut level so you need to complete all these things to unlock the next one otherwise you cannot enter this like this you get under construction so for everything you will get like new maps so let's check this thing here anti-villain league so th this map goes with uh, the map structure is the anti-villain league like this for every mm, level or for every fruit level you will get one map and lot of obstacles and um, lot of power up kind of things so you can use them to increase your quality of gaming and this is the minion shield if you use this shield you, you cannot die even if you hit anything so like this the game goes on so we can say this is complete entertainment as once you download it you have to complete one bunch of games to go to the other thing and there are some special mission kind of things and everything you will get and sometimes the special missions and sometimes the global the, uh, uh, races and events and you will get some special rewards like this the game goes on and the minion characters are really really cute if you want you can buy them for real money or you can earn coins you can uh, earn coins or tokens uh, some for coin means bananas here so the tokens and the bananas you can unlock some characters the <clears throat> bananas you can easily collect the bananas here but uh, you can buy hardly three or four characters with bananas you need the tokens the tokens are really really hard to collect so uh, though it is a running game but it's completely different from all running games so for every mini for every mini game you will you have to finish a task and if you finish the task you can go to the other level like this so this is about the mini and rush so let's go to the subway surfers the subway surfers is also a running game as we all know but this is like a different game completely different so here the characters are like um, the special characters let's go to the characters first here the characters resembles like uh, the basic character let's start with the basic character jake 
So he is the um, basic character of this thing, and the remaining things like this is you have to collect your force for this character and guitars for Spike. The speakers are some kind of what we call stereo stereos for fresh, fresh, and she is also you can buy for coins and this is the dino special dino special character he if you log into facebook you can get so these are like realistic characters and as the world tour is going on we it's, have it's special guy lee mm, lee is from china and she's from morocco he's from ireland and she's from rio like this the characters are really realistic and like um, the speciality characters it's Coco. Yeah, she's like a um, mine specialist or um, it's mine two, artist two kind of thing. dollars. Yes. And you can change the outfits like this. She is like a clown now. So like that, the characters goes on. And unlike in Minion Rush, you... You need the orange it, it orange. doesn't Like the game doesn't have any mini game kind of things. It has like the map, the map is in subway and you have to run through the subway escaping from the trains and the other obstacle kind of things. And there in Mini and Rush, um, like uh, they give you some tasks to complete. But here also there are like daily challenge, everyday daily challenge and weekly hunts and some missions to increase your multiplayer kind of things and you yeah, are the policeman and the dog like this the will follow you here and you need yeah. the keys to use for save me there you, you have to use the tokens here we have to use the keys and one more thing is here the boards here the boards play important role like um, the minions have some kind of vehicles power ups and everything here the boards so there are so many boards like this some are some world tour specials and some for sale and what, what this is, is the basic hover board what is special for the board that's a rickshaw so like this rickshaw oh yeah. If you double tap this, you can get the board here. And if you are on the board, even if you hit anything, you cannot like you can play. You won't die. So the play the boards play a very important role here. But one thing is, unlike in Mini and Rush, uh, you cannot save the maps or you cannot save the levels to play again. The map will be available when it is there. Uh, once the map is like, once the, um, like for one month or something, one map will be there. And after that, you cannot play the map. And here you can buy the, the starter pack here and the coins, double coins. And the hoverboards, the mystery box, like this you'll get some these kind of things yeah if you get this character yeah if you unlock these things you will get the itani character the score booster head start and you, even if you can just skip the missions and this jetpack yeah these are the power ups uh, if you use these kind of things your the quality of game will you don't, increase you don't die and go to the shop oh yeah shop is this thing so the awards here so they will give you some tasks if you complete the thing you, you can get these keys as the keys play important role like uh, you have to if you want to use the save me option and this one top run yeah you need those things and even if you upgrade any character or board you need those things like uh, the keys and here in the top run top run will show you the rank of your gameplay and here the weekly hunt based on the theme of the 
city you will get this weekly hunt as we are in china special shanghai city we have to collect these plants look like uh, and we the missions like you every time you need to complete three um, set of missions like this to go to the other level and the daily challenge you need to collect the letters of one word to get the to complete the daily challenge here for every wednesday you'll get one character if you didn't buy the character you can buy him or her here and the hoverboards if you want more hoverboards you can buy the basic hoverboards are the special hoverboards will cost you like 50000 coins and you can buy them when it is available so this is the thing about subway surfers uh, as we can see both are the subway surfers and minion rush both are running games but there is even one similarity between these two games they are completely different like starting from characters power ups and the missions and the maps and everything like completely different from one uh, one another so yeah we can play these games like a change uh, if you play so this first for a while you, if you want a break you can play the mini and rush like that you can switch one another to play so both the games are like uh, um completely entertaining here also if you complete the weekly hunt daily challenge and everything still there are so many characters and the characters are and boards are very expensive so you have to play and play and play otherwise you can buy the coins or keys but if you really really want some entertainment you can play the game like forever and collect the coins collect the keys to unlock the hoverboards characters and everything for every day like uh, for monday tuesday and wednesday there are some special missions available here like uh, mini and rush for every mini game you need to complete some missions here we have to uh, complete the missions every day like the mission will be available for 24 hours and for saturday and sunday the um, the wordy weekend uh, will be available for 48 hours and if you didn't buy any character and if you still want the character you can buy them on those days so these are the things about subway surfers and minion rush thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe